Okay, we're entering into the tomb of David. To the tomb of David. And uh, as you can see, they are praying and singing as we're entering into the tomb of David. And that's Muslim Rabbi Stephen Benjamin. He is doing a great job leading us today. Okay, there's a group in there right now, so we're going to enter in here in just a moment. All right. Okay, we're about ready to enter into the tomb of David. And here we go. This is the tomb of David. It's very important and of course a very holy site. Tomb of David. Is there something Stephen you want to say here? This is where uh, it is traditionally believed that the king of Israel, king of Israel David, uh, Melech David, is actually believed to be buried here. It is a holy site for the Jewish people, and uh, any place of burial of a, of a prophet or a king is like this. So we'll actually be going later to the tomb of Samuel as well, uh, another place not far from here. So God bless you. Very, thank you, Steve. It's very important, isn't it? Yes, it is. Very important. Very important. So for Judaism, it's, a, it's an important site, right. you know, right. because they're waiting for the resurrection. Right. And that's what they're believing in, the coming of Mashiach. Right. And they also know that when Mashiach comes, David again will once again rule here in Jerusalem. Right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Of course, we believe that to be a prophecy that it's to the greater David. Yes, we do. That it's Yeshua that actually yes. reigns himself. Yes. Uh, the son of David. The son of David. Yes. Exactly. Uh, Amen.